Hello, yes. Today, I'm going to show you how to get whatever gamer picture you want for free. And uh, with a flash drive, you could do the same thing with a, with a hard drive. You just need a lot more complicated stuff like a, like a um, you know, migration cable. Just Okay, make sure your profile is on your flash drive. Your Xbox Live profile is on your flash drive, and then plug in, ah, plug your flash drive into the computer, and then when this pops up, you know, click exit out, and um, I'm gonna, you need Modio X Taf and Profile Editor 2.5. I'll put all of those up in the description so you can download. So first of all, open up X Taf. Uh, yeah, open up XTAF and then file, open drive. Make sure your files on your flash drive and your flash drive is plugged into the computer. Root content. Your first one should be your profile. Maybe it's not, it doesn't really matter. Um, you're gonna, first of all, make a new folder on your desktop called backup. Backup. And then, um, extract your profile to the backup folder. Make sure, yeah, you extract your profile to the backup folder. And when that's done, open up your backup folder, copy it to the desktop. Paste. And then what you're going to do is, hold on, wait, you don't have to do any of this right now, so hold on, wait one second. Alright, now what you're going to do is, um, Minimize XTAF. Uh, open up Profile Editor 2.5. Yeah, open up Profile pro Open up Profile Editor 2.5. Um, I'm gonna stop the film right now because this takes a while to do. All right, hold on. Yeah. Um, actually, no, not right now. And then go to Open up at the top left corner. And then open up your profile that's on your desktop. Yeah, um, hold on. This takes a while. Hold on. Sorry about this. Alright, um, and it should create a folder up called E, well, yeah, it's the same number as your profile, it's just a folder. And, um, uh, so now my profile is opened up on, a uh, profile editor, and then, and then what you're gonna do is, say uh, minimize that, and then, uh, yeah, you see the new folder, it's, it's your number, uh, of the, of your profile, and mount PT at the end, open up. And then what you're gonna do is uh go to go to the internet. Loading. And then go you can go to like just download any from any website. I'm just gonna go to Google Images. And then um I'm just gonna search for COD thirty two by thirty two. Yeah, you need two of this two things of the same picture um one's 32 pixels by 32 and the other one should be 64 by 64 so um yeah here's a good picture right here I'm gonna use this one uh it's hard to it's probably hard to see on yours but it's right here it's, uh it's just a the Call of Duty World at War logo right click it save image as um, I'm gonna save it to the desktop And um, and make another one sixty four by sixty four. Uh, that should be the other one. Okay, here it is again. It's just a big resolution. And then save it. And then uh. And then.
they, they both are on your desktop. They should be the same picture, just different re resolutions. And then, um, name the 32-bit, by 32-bit one, name it, uh, tile, T-I-L-E, underscore 32. And the 64 by 64 one, tile, underscore 64. And then, and then, op um, use it, open up your mount PT folder that the provider thing created. And then drag those two pictures inside that folder. And then uh, override them. Yes to all. And then uh, you should have override them. And then once you open them, you see the you know, pictures that you downloaded. If you have a picture that's like too big, or uh, yeah, you can edit it on like paint or something. And uh, yeah, that would work. Yeah, you open it up on paint and then uh, change the resolution. Make sure these. F uh, Files are PNGs. Make sure they are PNGs. And then go to the next side of that. Go open up Profile Editor uh, again. And then um, click Save. And then hold on the Save online. I'm going to exit out of these things that I do not need anymore. Hold on, it's still saving. I'm sorry for the wait, but shaving. Oh, it should almost be done. Come on. Hurry it up. I'm sorry for the wait, guys. On YouTube, you know, you can just skip past this wait. Uh, almost. Come on. Alright, here it is. Now, uh, it should, down at the bottom right, your profile should pop up with your new, uh, gamer picture. That means it's saved. And then, uh, you can go ahead. Yeah, if, if it has your new gamer picture on there, you've done it right. Go ahead and, uh, exit out of it. And then, um, you've got your profile on the desktop. And uh, open up Modio. It's opening. Hold on. Please do not open this door. Oh Alright. Here it is. Alright, it's open right now. Modules open. And then your modded one, the one that you uh, have on the desktop, uh, is right here. Drag it into Modio. And then. And then, um. It has your old picture on it. I'm not sure why, but it just does. Then uh, go to the yeah new window inside of Mario pops up. At the bottom right, click Resign and Rehash. At and then at the bottom left, when it's done resigning rehashed, it says Resigned and Rehashed. Um, right there. And then wait until it says Xbox 360 dashboard again. Go and exit out of that. Exit out of that. Bring XTF back up. And then you see you have your old profile, the non-modded one. Right-click it and delete it. And then drag your modded one into there. And then it's almost done. And then it's done. Uh, there's your modded one with your new gamer picture on it. Go ahead and uh, exit out of that. Yeah. And then put a, put your flash drive into the Xbox. Um, Crap, it's still recording. Uh and um and uh yeah, and then load up your profile, you should have it. I've heard uh I'm not sure really sure if I said this before, maybe I haven't, but um uh some people can sometimes they can see your new pa your new gamer pictures, sometimes you they can't. And um here 
Well, um, have, if you have any questions uh, or comments, please leave it below in the comment box. Uh, thank you.